Well, fans were quick to react to the decision to fire Greg Hyatt. I think it's unfortunate, you know, a true leader really does take responsibility for whoever it is that they are over. Um, a team is a team and a leader, if they can't lead, they have to go. Uh, I think I think that's the right course of action. Um, I mean, hazing is it's unacceptable. Um, I know um, with the previous coach, uh, like they said, nothing like this ever happened when Jans was here. So, I mean, it's just sad to hear that things like this are going on. Yeah, I mean, you're coming into a program where they've had, you know, legendary coaches, right, and stuff, and uh, something like this happens within your first year. Kind of a tough year. Hire went 9-15 and 15 in his only season at NMSU. He won just two conference games. He replaced Chris Jans, who led the Aggies to three Western Athletic Conference Tournament Championships and four regular season titles. While Hire did not see any immediate success, the Aggies did attract solid crowds. NMSU averaged nearly 5,000 fans a game this season. That ranks 93rd out of 367 NCAA Division I programs. It is the second highest in the WAC. Our sister station in El Paso, KTSM, spoke to a former NMSU athletic director about where the program goes from here. We are now owning up to it and we're making changes. We're gonna bring in the right kind of coach. And we're gonna bring in the right kind of players and we want you to help us, help us. You're gonna to have to help us, you're gonna to have to continue to support us, but be part of this whole new regiment that we're bringing in and be part of the building process. Hire's $300,000 salary was among the lowest at the D1 level. Just for context, U.S. Today reported back in 2021, the Texas Southern head coach had the lowest salary in the country at $250,000 a year. Hire coached college basketball for more than 20 years, but NMSU was his first head coaching job at the D1 level. His only other head coaching experience came at the junior college level, leading Chipola College in Mariana, Florida from 2004 to 2009, and Northwest Florida State College in Niceville in 2021 and 2022. Hire did have D1 experience as an assistant at Southern Miss, Wichita State, LSU, and East Tennessee State. Coming up in the next half hour, we'll take a deeper look at Hire's brief but tumultuous time with the Aggies. We'll also have more in our later newscast. And of course, the latest information is always at krqe.com.